Hello everyone, this is Trevor Bates with PDS Equipment. Today I'm going to show you all how to create a favorite. Uh, this is going to limit you from having to create special plates every time you bring a job in. There may be certain jobs that, that you just um, run a lot of and you, and you want to have a favorite that you can bring in and boom, it's already set up ready to rock and roll. So I'm going to go over that with you all today. Uh, the one stipulation with the favorites is you can only create a fav favorite with one special plate. So if you need a job with primer and white, you will not be able to do that. This is more for white on the bottom or a white on top with reverse image type deal. Alright, so I have selected my job. I'm going to come over here first to the special plate. And we're going to do a favorite with white on the bottom. We're going to do 100% and we're gonna do valid pixel. So I'm gonna select white, 100, 100. Valid pixel, because I only want the white behind the image. And I am going to go ahead and composite this automatically. And I'm gonna select it on the bottom, because every time I select this favorite, I want the job to go ahead and tie in. Um, the most important thing with creating a favorite is this checkbox right here automatic creation. You must remember to check this and then hit create. What this is going to do is it's going to create my white plate and tie it in. Um, a very important step when creating favorites is to know I cannot leave this screen and I have to come up here to favorite. I now am going to enter in a name for this favorite and add it to my system. So a good name for this is going to be, uh, maybe you have a certain resolution you want to bring it in at. So we'll say 600 by 600 with white valid. We might even go ahead and go as far as to say with white 100, 100 valid. What I'm going to do is add this to the system, create it. I'm then going to come up here and do update. That's going to take all the information we just did on that job and update it. Currently it's showing me clear with zero density, whole image. When I click update, it will update it. Okay, so now it's showing you all the um, information we just put in. And I can come back here to the properties tab and we can bring in another job file open navigate to where we want to be and if you look over here on the right side we now have multiple favorites this 6042 is going to be my default i now have 600 by 600 with white 100 100 valid so i'm going to select it and click open now it's going to bring in my job bring it down here to the bottom and it's going to go ahead and automatically tie in a white plate now it's tied in and you're good to go so this is something you can do for a lot of different jobs you may want to reverse this as well as you know turn it on a 90 and and you can create a favorite to do that every single time so if you were doing tumblers and you wanted to turn it on a 90 and have a hundred percent underneath you can do that um, you can also build off of this favorite so if i wanted to turn this on a 90 i could come in here and go to rotation 90 degree and then come over here to favorite on the left select this here I'm now going to come here and update this favorite and you can see it's now turned it on a 90 so now this job will get brought in with white 100% valid pixel and be turned on a 90 just to show y'all, we're gonna bring in another job so you can see. So I'm gonna come back to the properties, I'm gonna go File Open. We're gonna select any job. 
We're going to make sure we're checked on the favorite we want and click open. It's going to bring this job in. So I brought the job in now. It's working on tying it in together. And we'll go into general print and make sure that it turned it on a 90 for us. So we'll come over here into general. And there it is, turning on a 90. It's because we have this selected and that's part of the favorite. So this is just something you all can do and build off of, you know, whatever job you may need create your own favorite it's going to increase your workflow and your production quite a bit so once again this is trevor bates with pds equipment if you have any more questions on this feel free to give me a call at 615-866-7453 thank you